Now, I'm going to answer um, a question that we get a number of times, and I've answered in, a many, uh, in, a, um, in many, many ways, but I'll, I'll answer again in this video again. The question is, uh, what is the difference between the, the cheapest of the plasma pen devices that I can find on eBay and the, the most expensive one that, uh, I don't know, say for example, the Plexa? The difference is in uh, marketing and proof that it will do what it is meant to do. So both marketing and the proofs that um, is going to do what is meant to do uh, are going to drive the price up. Let's say, for example, uh, the Plexer has got still up to this day, up, according to the uh, information we've got, it's got still three, only three power levels, three handheld devices uh, with a nice screen and whatnot. Uh, whereas the cheapest one that we find that we like um, uh, is, I think, 10, 10, 10 to 20 dollars and it works really well uh, in terms of generating a spark and it's got uh, I think 9 to 10 power levels and so it is funny the fact that you've got a smaller device you've got more power levels more dynamic for pretty much next to nothing and you've got the plexa which is no dynamism absolutely zero dynamism none none only three power level and in a design that is, uh, is just like punch in your face. And still maybe they're selling it, I'm not sure. Certainly they're not uh, as successful in the UK any longer, um, especially due to competition. But um, with the Plexa, for example, you get this CE Medical, which is a proof that is safe for medical application, plus the, the amazing amount of marketing that they spend on uh, going to exhibitions and whatnot. Um, the other... Uh, end of the spectrum, you've got the um, the ten to twenty dollar uh, Chinese device, which has got zero marketing spent, um, almost direct from the the factory um, to your doorstep with minimal instruction and no help whatsoever. So this is the uh, the main difference, and obviously, if you get a Chinese one, which is very very cheap, it could lead. In theory to the same results but you do not have the proof you're gonna build it yourself and you're gonna um, work on trust um, so this is the main difference hopefully it's quite clear because um, it is they are both both the plexer and the ten dollar uh, device that you can find on ebay still generate an electrical arc which is a plasma fiber blast you call it what you want to call it um, this is the main difference. You get charged 10 to 20 dollars in one case and a few thousands uh, thousand euros in the other case plus VAT. In the case of the 10 to 20 dollars, you don't even get charged VAT. <laughs> Funny enough. So, but what support do you, but I mean, what support do you get with one and what support do you get with the other one? And um, if you're a a large cosmetic clinic or an established doctor maybe you want to get the plexa or which is I don't know, six ten thousand pounds i don't know for um in, for you to do less have less dynamism in a big box that costs much more and does less in practice than the 10 to 20 dollar device that you can find on ebay this is a fact, um, check it yourself. Um, maybe we're gonna do a review on the Plexa because I bought, uh, I think it, yeah, it was in 2013, uh, one, and I still got it in, in there. <laughs> and uh, maybe we're gonna do a review uh, for what it's worth. Um, but yes, hopefully that answers the question and uh, uh, let us know if you'd like to know more.